Alrighty, good day and welcome. My name is Mr. Bent and today we're going to be going through a quick tutorial in Photopea on using the Spot Healing Brush. Now I'm going to drag an image in here. Um, to access this image, I have it down in the description below. We're just going to be using this as our demo to kind of work through removing some stuff. Um, so we can remove pretty much every single one of the cows in this image using the Spot Healing Brush. Now there's a couple other ways that you can remove images from the background, remove things like that. Some of them take longer than others, but I'm just gonna show you the quick way. This doesn't work on everything, but it'll work on a majority of the small things that you have. Um, so I'm just gonna select the, the Spot Healing Brush, which is here to the left. Your quick button is also J, if you wanna select that. And then I'm just gonna go over to one of the cows. So we'll start with this one here, this little one right here. Now all you're gonna do is use it just like a brush and you're gonna click and hold until you've covered pretty much the entire cow, a little bit of some area around it. You wanna grab some of that area because that's going to grab some of those pixels to use to recreate where that cow is standing. So as you can see, that has now removed that cow and it looks pretty dang good. Um, sometimes this works better than others. For example, if you've got something that's on two backgrounds, if I were to sit here and highlight this whole cow, Sometimes it works really well, just like that, but other times it will not. So a way to do that is if you had this cow, for example, you could do its legs because that's on the green part of the background. So you just kind of go over a couple swipes on the green. There's that mid brown. You're gonna kind of go over that again, same idea. And then with the top layer, erase that. There's a few ways to do this. Um, you can just kind of split up your image or you can highlight the whole thing, similar to what I'm doing. Um, for these cows that are here in the background, in the tall grass in the bush, I'm just gonna do little quick presses. So I'm just gonna press on them, little quick pokes. You can highlight a larger area if you wish, but the little quick poke works quite well. Um, I'm gonna remove this one back here as well. Awesome. So those cows are pretty much non-existent now in this image. Again, the ones that are taking up more space. So if I were to highlight these two larger cows, sometimes it works better than others. Bam, removed. Now again, depending on what you're removing, depending on its background, it might not work perfect every time, might take a couple go-overs, you might have to do, do it and break it up into chunks. Uh, but this is a nice quick way to remove stuff from your background, remove images that you don't want, that random person standing in the background of your photo, whatever. This is a great quick way to try and do that um, as a quick first attempt. With that all being said, this is our tutorial for today. This is all that we're gonna run through really quick, really easy. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I hope that you learned something. Have a wonderful day and take care.